Well, inside of the Sky River Casino, it's packed with people gambling or watching one of their many TV screens on the inside. But what about the outside? Soon, guests and visitors are going to start to see a lot more Elk Grove police officers in this parking lot, and it's a welcome sight for everybody. Driving on Highway 99, you can't miss it. A line of traffic leading to the brand new bright blue letters of the Sky River Casino. I am very excited about this place. Open only for a few weeks, Elk Grove's newest attraction draws thousands every day. But how do residents nearby feel about their new neighbors? Like all of these streets were just filled with uh, casino goers, and that was uh, off putting. A challenge the casino and local law enforcement had to overcome. Help control traffic around here and to make sure they don't come into this neighborhood and cause drunken problems. Elk Grove is on it. The city council adopting a resolution that provides additional officers to the casino when needed. We reached out to the Elk Grove Police Department to ask them how it works. Off-duty officers can participate in the extra duty employment program, allowing them to work security for private businesses or events. The off-duty hours are approved by the chief, but will it pull officers and resources from other parts of the city? The department says no. Writing, the extra duty program does not affect our ability to provide the high level of service our community expects and deserves. Given that this is a casino, you would think there's a lot of money here and people walk out with money. so. I would say, yeah, it's important to have security. The off-duty officers are paid by the casino based on an agreement between the business and the city that reads in part, Wilton Rancheria will reimburse the city at the average overtime rate. As long as the police officers here in Oak Grove are doing their job, which they always do, I'm all about it. That's unclear how much the casino will spend on these off-duty officers. The officers that are here are going to be marked in their uniforms and their patrol cars. And the amount of officers, of course, will depend on the day. So the weekends will likely have more police officers in this parking lot.